Hey superstars, I'm Sue and welcome to my channel, Reviews with Sue. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back and supporting our channel. If you're new here, welcome. I'm Sue and I hope you consider hitting that subscribe button. So would you like to know what today's unboxing is all about? Well, let me show you. It is the Tokyo Charm Box. And if you want to know what's inside this box, then just keep on watching. Doing reviews just like I do. Hanging out with your friend Sue. It's Sue. And I'm back. And I have the Tokyo Charm Box here for September 2022. If you're not familiar with the Tokyo Charm Box, let me tell you a little bit about it. But first of all, guess what? It's brand new to my channel and I'm so excited I'm able to share it with all of you guys. So what the Tokyo Charm Box is, it is a monthly Japanese self-care subscription box, which also may include some lifestyle type of items. Now you're always gonna get anywhere between six and eight full-size items. The price of this box is $49.99 plus shipping. However, the Tokyo Charm Box did send me this over free for review, so I'm able to share it with all of you. And they gave me an awesome affiliate link as well as a discount code. And what that's gonna do for you is give you 15% off your very first box. I am so grateful to the Tokyo Charm Box for sending this over. I so appreciate it. I cannot wait to dive inside this box because what I've seen on their website is it is going to be totally fabulous. You can also follow them on Instagram as well as Facebook. All the information is going to be down below in the description box in case you have any interest in checking this box out for yourself or you just might want to gift it to someone because you know the holidays are going to be upon us before you know it. So let's go ahead and get into the box. This is what it looks like right here. Now when I did receive this box it did come in an outside box and it was packed very very nicely and it came into me in prestige condition as you can see right there. So when we open up the box let me see here. You open it up and ooh, look at how fancy it looks. It's all all pretty in pink tissue in there. There is a little sticker there. Now these items came all the way from Japan. I believe the shipping on this box is approximately $10, which is actually quite reasonable if you know it's coming all the way from Japan, of course. So inside here, we open up the tissue. It's kind of like a hard tissue. It's not like tissue paper. It's more of like a, a kind of like a paper paper. I don't know why I have to tell you that, but I just feel like I want to tell you all the details. Then right on top, it shows us it looks like all the items that's gonna be in the box. I'm seeing one, two, three, four, five, and then I'm seeing six, seven, eight, nine, 10. I think we're gonna get 10 items in this box, you guys. Oh my goodness. So this is what the little brochure looks like. It's just like a one-sheeter here. And then, oh my gosh, the presentation on this is gorgeous. Check this out. Let me give you a quick little sneaky peek there. So the foozles that I usually call it is more like, like a grassy material, like almost like paper. It is super pretty. It's pink. And you guys know I just love pink. And oh my gosh, this is, I'm telling you, it's going to be a gorgeous unboxing, I'm thinking here. So let's see here. Where should I start? Well, the very first item I'm seeing is this item right here and it has one of those like little tissues here on there so this is the first item right here it says on here this is a dishcloth especially for you it is 30 by 30 and let's see here oh there's two of them <gasps> look at we got two of them look at how pretty oh and it even came so nicely wrapped so if you wanted to like re-gift any of these items you definitely could so here is the first one I'm trying to see like what's the print on here it looks like are there, I think they're like little birds and maybe little um, little like footprints, you know, like when they're in the sand and you see the little footprints of the birds and then it looks like there's some little flowers there. But look at how pretty this is. And it does look like this is a 100%, it just says 100% and I can't read the rest of it. So I think it's cotton maybe, but there is the first one. I think these are maybe dish towels. And this is the second one. And oh, this one's so pretty too. Here is this one right here. Now let me see if I can find it here on my sheet because you know, there's like a lot of stuff on here. This is called the Japan Dish Cloth. It is 100% cotton made of high quality cotton and non-toxic dyes, durable for the environment and friendly and soften after every wash. So each time you wash it, it's gonna get softer and softer it sounds like. So there is our first item and we got two dish cloths. So these are gonna be kind of like, I guess our lifestyle items. Okay, well, you know, I think this might be a lifestyle item too. So I'm just gonna go ahead and get into this next one. So this one here came off all nicely bubble wrapped and inside here I'm thinking this is going to be the Japan porcelain bowl yes we even got a bowl so it's all wrapped up in the bubble wrap and then it's wrapped up again nicely here so I'm sure it made it to me safely oh my gosh this is gorgeous everything's gonna be gorgeous you guys 
Look at that. Okay, so let me show you my porcelain bowl. Look at the little flowers in there. I love it. Oh my gosh, look at how pretty that is. Here is the back. So it is just kind of like a cream ceramic. And then you can see it has like the purple flowers. This looks like kind of like a coral. And then maybe like a little bit of a green color there. It says 100% made in Japan, safe for daily use. Unlike plastic or wooden bowls, porcelain won't absorb odor or bacteria. Used for dishwasher, microwave, freezer, but not for the oven or a fire. Oh my gosh, you can even use, so I wonder, maybe I could even use this like maybe as a spoon rest in my kitchen, but no, it's too fancy. I almost feel like I need to put it in my bathroom because it's so pretty. And then it kind of like coordinates really well, you know, with the little washcloth right here. So nice, I like it, I like it a lot. This box is already fun, I can tell. Okay, then the next thing I have here is by Lulu Lun. I believe it is One Night. And this is what it looks like right here. This is a one night mask. Okay, so now it's telling us a little bit on how to use the mask, which I know most of us probably already know how to use it, but it says, first thoroughly cleanse and dry your face. Position the eye and the mouth parts and lightly press to adhere the mask to your whole face. Leave the mask on for 10 to 15 minutes. Remove the mask, fold and discard. The mask is also effective if it is lightly warmed with the palms of the hands. Ooh, that sounds pretty nice. So yay, look at that. And look, at, look, it's got some little eyelashes there. And then this is the back of it where it's going through the different steps of putting that on. So yay, we got us a mask there. I am having so much fun in here, you guys. And then next we have is this item right here. This is the BLC Momo Pure Essence Mist. You can use the mist anytime after using your makeup or if your skin feels dry during the day. Close your eyes and your lips and spray on approximately two to three pumps onto your face. So let's go ahead and get into this guy. And this bottle is like so cute. Okay, it is a plastic bottle, but it actually looks like it could be almost like glass. I really love the structure of that. I love the shape of it. And it does have the flat bottom. So of course you can stick it on your vanity. It's a really nice size too if you were to travel. So I just I did pull off the lid. So let's do a couple of little mists of this on my arm. Ooh, it's got a very fine mist. And I think it's, I think it's unscented because the only thing I can smell right now is kind of like an orange scent. And that is maybe my hand lotion or lotion that I did put on prior to the video. But awesome. I love this. And again, this would be perfect for traveling. Okay. Then the next item we have is this item right here. This is the Olivale Primer Booster Herbal Mask. So it looks like we have a mask here, but it is in a little box. It actually looks like a little book in there, doesn't it? Like if you were to put it like on the shelf, you could just see what it is and like pull it right off and put that face mask on. So inside here we have, ooh, we got more than one. So gosh, guys, guess what? This box is gonna be actually coming with more than just six to eight items it's looking like. So here are the masks right here. There is a set of, let me show you, totally a four of them here. And on this one, of course, you're gonna put it on your dry, clean face. And you are going to leave it on for approximately five to 10 minutes. After applying um, the mask, then you are going to perform your usual skincare process. So there is that right there. Nice. And four of them. That is like a huge score, I think. Okay. Then the next item we have is this one right here. This is the Keikito Medical Bath Salt. It says this bath product is medicated bath salt that contains natural ingredients of a hot spring. You can enjoy visualizing a hot spring from your own home. Fill your bathtub with hot water, approximately 150 to 200 liters, and dissolve one packet, 25 grams of this product well before bathing. So here it is right there. This is the packaging. Here is some more information on the back, but it looks like it's in Japanese, so I cannot read that part. So let's go in here and, oh my gosh, guys, this again is another full box. This is crazy. This is, I'm thinking I'm really gonna be liking this subscription. So inside here, there are, what? One, two, three, four, five different little bags. So these are for five baths. So I'm telling you, this is an awesome deal. So here they all are. They're actually all different colors. Now, I cannot read this, but I'm assuming this might be, it just might be different like scents maybe, because then there's a yellow one. There is a pink one. I can't wait just to put these on display in my bathroom because they're that pretty. There's that one. And then there's also that one right there. So yes, I'm really happy with that. Five bath salts. And it's going to make you feel like you're in a hot spring somewhere. Like your bathroom. So your bathroom is going to be like your new spa place to go. 
So the next thing we have here is the paper hand soap in peach flavor. Yes, you know me, I love me some peach. And this is the item right here. This is super duper cool. This is by V-E-C-U-A, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, honey. And this is the paper hand soap. It's suitable for all skin types. And inside here have, are these like little baby tissues, as you can see. So let me go ahead and pluck one out of here so I can show it to you a little bit closer. So it's just a tiny little sheet and this is going to foam up. It's good for all skin types. So if you are on the go and you're traveling and you happen to go to one of the rest stops and you don't see any soap around, if you have this little packet in your purse, you can wash your hands with this little guy here. Or say you're at a picnic and you've got some like greasy chicken fingers like I might have, you could actually just use a bottle of water in your hand to, to lather it up with. Or you could go to their drinking fountain or their restroom there if they have that. Or if you're on the go and you're camping, anything like that, you can use these for. And I just think they are really neat and I just love that packaging right there. So so there is that one. And then the next item is this guy right here. Now this is the Fancel Beautifully Blooming Hand Gel Cream. This product does not contain alcohol. Take the appropriate amount and let it in absorb well into your skin. So very interesting. I don't think I have ever tried a gel cream before. So here is a safety seal on there. So you can see that that is on there. So let me see if I can get that off and then we are going to just try a little bit of this. So here it is with it off and I'm just gonna put a little bit here on my hand. Oh, so it is like a cream. So you can see it is kind of like a thick cream right there. And then, oh, it does, okay. Ooh, interesting. So it did go kind of into a gel a little bit, but now it's going totally into my skin and it has a really faint fragrance of I don't know what, but it doesn't smell bad. That's all I know for sure. So I'm trying to rub a little bit onto my other hand, but if you can see there, it is very nicely moisturized. Please excuse the uh, aging skin that I do have. So let me go ahead and put the lid on that. And we still have a few more products to share with you. So next we have this guy right here. And this is the Pardo Skin Care Cleansing. Apply the appropriate amount to your skin, apply it all over your face, and then wash it off with cold or lukewarm water. For mascara that is difficult to remove, apply it first to make it easier to remove. Gently blend, blend into the wrinkles of the eyes. Can be used with wet hands and face. For makeup that's difficult to remove, use dry hands. Ooh, that is actually a very good tip. So there is that guy right there. And it feels like there's quite a bit in there. It doesn't tell me the ounces, but you can see from this side, there is the bottle right there. So we have that. And then I think we're on to our last item. Oh, I'm so sad. All good things have to come to an end, but I'm thinking this was an awesome box. And then for our very last item, we have this one right here. This is the Bath Candy Lavender. Please remove the packaging before use, use as a bath bomb. But look at the packaging on that. Look at how flipping adorable that is. It really looks like a piece of candy. I wish I could eat it, but I won't, I promise. But let me see. Ooh, I can't smell anything. Mm, I wanna smell it. But it's all sealed up like really nice. You can see it's all tied up right there. And then it even has like a sticker right there. So I'm assuming once I take it out of the package and drop it into my bathtub, it is going to smell divine because lavender is such a soothing kind of a scent. So let's do a quick little recap because I thought this box was awesome and I wanna hear your feedback in the comments down below of this new amazing box that I'm showing here on my channel. So the first thing we have are the lifestyle items. So we have two washcloths right here. So we got the two washcloths. Then we have this porcelain dish right here, which again, you can use it in the microwave, you can use it in the dishwasher, you can put it in the freezer. I'm not sure why you would, but you can put it in your freezer. Remember, you cannot put it in the oven though, but it is totally gorgeous and I am loving that. Then we have the facial mist right here. We have the hand lotion gel right there. We have the face cleanser right here. We have our candy bath bomb right there. We have the tissues that you can actually use to wash your hands with because they're going to foam up and they're good for all skin types. Then we also received five packages of bath salt that is going to make your bathtub feel like a spa, I'm assuming. We have this face mask right here. And then we also received another whole packet of four more face masks. What did you guys think of the box? Do you love it? Do you like it? Do you wish you had it? Do you want mine? Well, you know you can't have mine, but what I can do for you is leave my affiliate link down below in the description box. I'm also going to give you that discount code that you can receive 15% off your very first box. I do want to thank Tokyo Charm so much for sending this over. I so appreciate it. And 
I'm loving it. I'm loving everything, seriously. So my favorite items are going to be the hand soaps right here. These little tissues are going to be a lifesaver, I'm telling you. And I do really like this facial mist. It had like a really nice fine mist to it. And the lifestyle items. I love lifestyle items, you guys. So I'm liking a lot of things in here. And I actually love everything, but those are just a few of my favorites. Please let me know in the comments down below what your favorite item is I received in my box today. If I have any giveaways going on, I'm going to leave those linked down below in the description box. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe. A like on your way out would be great. And if you have any extra time, hop on over to Instagram. Follow me over there. It's Reviews with Sue, just like my channel name. And don't forget, you can also follow the Tokyo Charm Box over there as well. So that's all I have for you guys today. Please be safe, be well, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!